Hi guys, Vista here, Valiant Fish Tech, and I'm really tired today, guys. But I cannot skip the oxygen hoist oh, open better 14, right? So cheer me up, and to cheer me up, I just opened myself a Czech beer, so no other does in here. But it's gonna be like a beer update video, guys. Okay, oxygen open beta 14. Let's see the change log. Fix the problem that some software voice input cannot be recognized. Fix the problem of the disappearance of contacts in the address book on some devices. More clock style options now available in ambient display. When you go to settings, customization, clock styles, and I think that's pretty much the only one real thing we can see and touch and test. Improve system stability and fix general issues. You know, my favorite you know, part of the change log ever. And finally, updated Android security patch to the May version. It is today, guys, the 19th of May. So OnePlus, if you're looking my videos, maybe in five years, you have to be quicker, guys, right? Promise. Phone. Now you can view call recording and call history. Move to the call history, click the three time dot menu on the upper right to access the call recording. Now I cannot test this guys because I'm not using call recording. Um, you know, it's 182 megabytes. But the biggest question I have is why don't I get this thing over the air? I have to always use the Oxygen OS Open Better updater, the OS Oxygen updater to get the latest Open Betas. So guys, if you want to get the Open Betas like I do, quicker than your, the regular OTA, then just check out the oxygen update the best app ever all right guys so downloading the update my download will start soon and with that said actually my download already started i'm gonna be back here guys when this has been downloaded i'm gonna show you guys how i can install this manually and actually probably you know we're going to even do this right now because you know my internet is scanning it today all right, it was a busy day. I hope your day was not so busy compared to what I had. All right, almost there. Almost there, 72%, 75%. Okay, now guys, when you use the OS Oxygen Updater, then you need to just go and do the following thing. So go here to Cockwheel, go on System, right? And then go System Update, and then go here again and then choose local upgrade. And then I'm gonna get the file here, and we know it's the file from today. Press it, install now, and boom, there you have it. Usually when you're using the open betas, you should get also a notification to just get it directly from the servers from OnePlus over the air. I'm not sure what happens. I don't get them, you know, probably since five, four versions behind, but I don't really care because I have the Oxygen OS updater. So while I'm enjoying my Czech beer, guys, I'm gonna leave my phone here and I'm gonna be back when everything is pretty much installed so we can at least test the new clock styles in the always on display. Did I say it correctly, always on display? That sounds wrong because we don't have AUD here, we just have the ambient display, all right? So hopefully in the next iteration of OS Oxygen, probably it's gonna be version 12. We're gonna get also always on display. All right, guys, let me finish up my beer and then this thing hopefully is installed and we can test it. Ninety-nine percent. We are almost there. And I have here my little helper. He's a big fan of Oxygen OS. Rebooting the phone now, guys. That's the moment where you have the fingers like this, and you just hope that the phone is going to shine again. Now I have to give great thumbs up to OnePlus. I probably did fourteen of this already. I never got a problem, you know, with. Um, my OnePlus phone, we uh, know two versions ago that it was an issue with the version they released. Okay, but let's not talk about that right now. Anyway, even that version, you know, there was a way people found out how they can make it work. First boot, guys, always after you go to the next version, can take a little bit more time, so give it a patient. And let's just be here back when this is up and running. And again, this time, I hope I'm gonna finish up my beer. Charm of Czechia, brewed in the Czech Republic. You know, actually a very nice beer, guys. I think it's the second time I had this beer yesterday. My wife found that beer and uh, we had a sip of that. And today I'm doing uh, like a, another test. Not a bad beer, guys. If you can buy it somewhere, Parazatska beer, brewed in the Czech Republic. And you know the Czech guys, I mean, obviously, right? Beer nation, top guys.
cool. All right, let me finish it up. Ah, my God. My beer finished, oxygen OS open, beta 14, still not shining on my phone, so we need to wait a little bit more. Okay, guys, we are here, phone is starting. First thing we want to check, just go back through the settings, right? Then scroll down, go to about phone, and then we can see here, open, cut. And then we can see here, OnePlus 7 Pro, Oxygen OS, open beta 14, right? Now let's check the new clock styles. We need to open the drawer, go here to settings, go to customization, and then hopefully here, clock style. So when we select clock styles, guys, friendly, yeah, wow, okay, yeah, this one looks nice. Okay, bolt, oh, okay, very bold, analog. Honestly, I even was not aware what was there before. Oh, but when we do it like that, okay, yeah, let's see. I'm in display, you see what happens? Oh, wow, okay. When I just put the finger there, and I get now the new clock faces. All right, not so bad, not so bad. Let's try with the bold one, guys, just because, you know, it's, it's just bold. Yeah, you see what I did here? Let's select that one. You get a notification. Hey, VST, how are you doing? I'm doing a nice video about the new latest Oxygen OS Open Beta 14. Boom. Oh, yes, we got the bold clock face. But you know what, guys? Forget about this. It's ambient display. And people are screaming and shouting, OnePlus, just, it's 2020 already, like May. Please give us always on display. And with that, guys, I'm going to conclude my video because I need to go for a refill. I hope that you did like my video. Yeah, if not, sorry about that, but I really hope you're gonna check again in some days, probably new video. Have a nice rest of the day or the evening. And with that said, VST over and bye. And now you know I need to throw something, guys, so I'm gonna just throw this for a dramatic effect. <laughs> bye now.